Are you thinking of living in Sacramento and want to know what it's really like? Well, in this video, I'm going to give you the good, the bad, and the ugly. Hi, I'm Art Gilchrist, and welcome to another episode of Parent Sac. Let's start with the good. The first thing we love is the outdoor activities. You can run and walk and bike on the American River Trail, along with dozens of other trails dotted throughout the city. There are several dog parks to explore with our furry family members, and you can find a farmer's market on almost every day of the week. And there's this cool little place you may not have heard of called Lake Tahoe, which is right up Highway 50, about an hour and a half away. The second thing we love about Sacramento is Midtown, where you can literally walk to art galleries, theaters, restaurants and bars, view historic homes, and Midtown is an awesome option if you like to do mom and pop shops and you want to get away from shopping at big box stores. The third thing we love is our wine regions. We have Lodi and Amador County and El Dorado County. Now, everybody knows I'm a wine guy and I'm here to tell you they're less expensive, they are less busy, and quite frankly, the wines are better than the wines in Napa. And I like Napa. All right, so now that you know what's totally awesome about Sacramento, let's talk about what could be better, also known as the bad. The first thing that's a little annoying is allergies. You may not know this about Sacramento, but we're also called the City of Trees. And from the redwoods to the palm trees near the capital to fruit trees everywhere, they just thrive in this climate. And that means the pollen can do a number on your sinuses. Second ugly, the cost of renting. Over half of all rentals in Sacramento fall between $2,000 and $3,000 a month. And that's right on par with mortgage payments. Obviously, you're better off buying than renting. Feel free to holler at your boy for help with that. The third ugly is a bit of a sore subject around here. The good part is we have an NBA franchise that plays in a beautiful state-of-the-art Golden One Center right in the heart of downtown. The bad news is that franchise is the Kings and they haven't been to the playoffs since 2006. And zoom in here, this thing was black back then. Anyone on the Kings roster happen to be watching this, uh, no hard feelings, I would be happy to help you sell or buy your home. Unfortunately, no place is perfect and we have some ugly to share with you. In July and August, it gets hot as fish grease. Absolutely nothing zaps your energy or jacks up your AC bill like three weeks of triple digit temperatures. Air conditioning is a must here. And pro tip, always be nice to your friends with swimming pools. Number two ugly, we have a pretty large homeless population. When you have mental illness and drug addiction and you couple that with high rents and perfect weather, it's kind of the perfect storm for homelessness to thrive. Coming in at number three, and some people say this is the worst, it's the Sacramento Zoo. It's awful, it's underwhelming. It's basically a petting zoo, but worse because you can't pet the animals. The good news is it's gonna be closing soon and Sacramento Zoo number two is already in the works. Well, I hope this video informed you of the good, the bad, and the ugly of living in Sacramento. Please hit the subscribe button below and for more videos, check out my channel or go to my website at harveygilchrist.exprealty.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Harve Gilchrist with the Realty of California. Buy or sell your home with Harve.